Customer service. Can you speak to Johnson, head cashier? Okay, hold on. Jonathan? Yeah. My name is John Briggs. Uh-huh. I, I got a little problem I said you could help me with. Okay. I uh, came in there, let's see, three days ago and got me some of y'all's nuts and bolts and one of y'all's little Ziploc bags. Uh-huh. Came in, purchased those, and here's all my receipt as a person that cashiered me out. Uh-huh. The problem is I got home with those things. I set them down on my counter. <clears throat> I got a hound dog. Uh-huh. He got into them that night. He, and I think he ate about six of those nuts and bolts, and he died. <laughs> well, it ain't funny. Huh? It ain't funny. It is? No, it ain't. I tell you what, because uh, he's uh, my hound dog for the last 13 years. Name, we called him Elvis, because when you sing Ain't Nothing But a Hound Dog, he kind of dance up on his hind legs, and Mama made him some blue sequins, blue side shoes for his feet. Uh-huh. But, but that, look, here's the problem. I mean... I'm not going to call and ask y'all to replace because there's only one Elvis. There's only one King. But I think I think what we're going to do to fix this problem is we're going to have him taxied army. And I was thinking since it is y'all's fault, you in particular counting those nuts and bolts and not locking that, sealing that bag back up, that is y'all going to pay for it to be him to be taxied army? <laughs> I, I'm going to have to talk to somebody else. No, sir, I've talked to three people already. It's to talk to you because you're the person... It was in charge of cashiering me out. You're the last person to touch that bag that was supposed to be sealed. Uh huh. And, and what does it say at the bottom of your receipt? It says Jonathan, cashier Jonathan. I talked to this lady just a minute ago about that. Jonathan, it doesn't keep a receipt on there. It doesn't have my name on there. Well, see, I talked to them. They said the cashier number and everything else. We had to go through a runaround. Uh-huh. But like I said, I think we can sell this one of two ways, Jonathan. We can do this one of two ways. I can come down there. And what? Uh, hang on just a minute. My taxidermy gave me the. It's gonna be two hundred twenty-two dollars and seventy-seven cents for that taxidermy to be done, or somebody's gonna get their tail whipped over there. Cause I am PO. Uh huh. I am a little PO'd about this. Hold on a second. No, sir, I can't. I've, I've been on hold three times. Jonathan. Yeah. John Briggs again. Uh-huh. Hey, listen, we're going to get this took care of. I'm going to hit you so hard your brother's teeth are going to fall out. You're going to hit me so hard my teeth are going to fall no, out? No, your brother's teeth. I'm going to hit you that hard. Listen, you owe me $272.77 for this taxidermy. No, it ain't. Listen, that ain't funny. You're giggling up the storm, but I'll tell you what, you're getting ready to get the storm of fists dropped on you. Am I? This is John Briggs. i tell you that much. And listen, I've already had to talk to three people while I was waiting for you to get back up here. Did you? And your supervisor said it was you to talk to. Uh-huh. What are we going to do? I'm coming down there today to pick up this check, or I'm going to drop a pop knot on your head about the size of a 50-cent piece. Are you? Yep. I guess you better bring your wife if you're going to do that. <laughs> Bull butter. I'll whip you like patting for a dance. You think so? I guarantee it. Oh, well. How big are you? I don't know if you want to try it. How big are you? I just don't think you want to try it. How big are you? Big enough. I doubt that very seriously. Really? Yep. I mean, uh, I guess you better come on in here because I'm getting ready to leave. Hey. 15 minutes. Well, you can give me the check or I can give you 272 and 77 cents worth of tail whip. Tail whip. What's it going to be? Uh, you can do whatever you want. I'll tell you what, Jonathan. I got a, a taxi who so might be able to take care of this a little cheaper. Uh, his name's Adam No. Uh-huh. You, you know an Adam No? I don't know Adam No. Is that right? Uh, <laughs> Jonathan. <laughs> hey, dude. Man. Hey, it's Adam.